a little higher Welcome to Guns and Chicken Strips. I'm your host James. What's happening? Today we're working on the Spartan mask here. Putting El Camaro, you know, to figure out some sort of mount over here somewhere for it. I don't know yet. I just don't know. But we're gonna get it. It's gonna be rocking. This is gonna go on here somewhere so that we can go interview people. I don't know about those people out there. You youngins if you watch The Price is Right or not. But I grew up on daytime TV when I was homesick from school watching The Price is Right. And Bob Barker always had a hilarious microphone. And this is what it was, right here. A microphone just like this. Giant, long microphone with a ball on the end. So I bought one and we are gonna interview people while wearing the Spartan helmet. I don't know who we're gonna interview, but we're definitely gonna interview the Guggen Squad on random things, and the questions we come up with are gonna be wild. Lots of the questions are gonna come from this brain right here, but also, I need help from you, the viewers, the cool people, the ones with the most creativity. I need you to come up with some questions, put them in the comments, and I will randomly ask people funny questions, Questions that will make somebody feel uncomfortable, but yet not make them feel harassed. You know what I'm saying? It'll be hilarious. We'll have it all mic'd up and I'll be like, so, what do you think? And I just think that's gonna be hilarious. Cause I got my Bob, Micro Bob Barker microphone. And if you don't know who Bob Barker is, Google Bob Barker, Bob Barker, the price is right right now. And you will see this giant hilarious microphone. Yeah, and this, we're gonna put, I think we're gonna put this on the side right here. I don't know. Okay, quick pause. I just got yelled at to go get us some food. Somebody's very, very hangry in the kitchen. Don't <laughs> I should never be trusted to go get food because I always end up spending too much money, but luckily this time it was not my money. <laughs> Check it out. Destroyed the Taco Bueno viciously. Now, I got this on here. I don't know if you can see that. Mounted to the helmet. Lighting's kind of bad, but that's okay. You get, you get the point. We're gonna put that on there and then go places wearing it. And then like I told you, we're gonna have this hooked up instead of that sometimes. We're gonna interview people like, so what do you think about climate change? And just shove that in their face. And then, then I'm just excited about this. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Lots of great memories are gonna be made with the Bob Barker mic action i love it i love it now we've got some unboxing to do i've got some stuff i ordered all the stuff i was talking about the rail mounts stuff like that for the guns this weekend especially i'm gonna try to get some close-up gopro footage of the hog destruction Let's start off with this and i'm not even sure what these are i ordered a bunch of random crap from Amazon just because it said same day delivery. It's addicting. I live right down the street from the Amazon warehouse. It's wild. Let's see. Ah, it's my sportsman mount. It's a regular sportsman mount to mount the uh, GoPro to the barrel like Lunkers uses on his paintball gun. So that'll be awesome right on the end of the barrel to get awesome barrel action. And I apologize for the little kid toy sounds, but it's Avery doing her thing, so we're not gonna interrupt her. You having fun, Avery? Avery! Avery! 
<laughs> oh, you're so cute. That was what was behind door number one. Now let's get to door number two. This I'm pretty excited about. You probably know what it is, a smart remote. That way I can turn the GoPro on and off without reaching up there all the time. Or when we're hunting, I can put it down by the, where the feed is and I can press it on and off. Yeah, that's gonna be sweet. For three. Well, they sent me the wrong one. They sent me for a hero four and not a five. That's okay. I'll just give this to Senior Lunkers. Okay, door number four, final door. We'll see what we can use these for. I know what these are. A Picatinny Rail GoPro mount. Sounds like you're saying Picatinny. Mm -hmm. Picatinny. <laughs> Picatinny Rail GoPro mount. Because they're only $4, but I had to wait two months for them because they came from China. Party rocking on a handstand. Now we're all decked out, got the gear we need to go hog hunting. I'm ready for it. Thank you for cooking, Sarah. You're welcome. <laughs> now doesn't that look amazing? I think it looks amazing. Yeah, sorry, <laughs> fell asleep last night editing. Didn't get to finish filming yesterday's video, so we're just gonna roll it into today. We're sitting here at the Turkle household. As you can hear Avery over there. We're sitting here at the Turkle household waiting on Mr. Turkle to get here. And I've gotta get ready for tomorrow's hunt. It's gonna be glorious. I'm hoping we see some, I really am. Hope it's not dead. I'm pretty sure we will. They've been seeing them there all week. So we're gonna get there, we're gonna set up, we'll take them down, take them down there, Stan. Now it's just a waiting game, waiting on Mr. Turkle to get here. He's not usually in a very good mood when he gets home from traveling. We'll see. I'm just sitting here answering, I'm just sitting here answering you guys' comments on my last video. You guys are awesome. Y'all's feedback means a lot. I really like how y'all are telling me what kinds of guns I should get. And I, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get me a hand cannon. OG Gaming, I used to have my, a spider was my very first paintball gun when I was about 13 years old. It was a good gun back then. But y'all about to munch down on some chicken Alfredo that Miss Turkla made. She's an amazing cook. And remember, be thankful when somebody cooks for you because Single guys like me don't get that very often. Oh my 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 well, as you can see, Mr. Lunkers is back from Colorado. Say hi. What is going on, guys? It is me, Lunkers TV, driving. And we are out running a few errands, <laughs> rocking. And by the time you watch this video, I will be knee deep in hog country. Hope you're in hog booty. Knee deep in that booty. Oh, no, no. Not gonna be make <laughs> that mistake again. Oh. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, hopefully knee deep in hog booty and all parts of hogs actually hope to have pieces of them all over me so It's gonna go down if I see a hog don't worry. They're going down We'll see you tomorrow. I hope you enjoyed this little short snippet of guns and chicken strips let me know what you think about my Bob Barker idea people that are old enough to know who Bob Barker is if not remember Google it I think it's a genius idea. So, hope you enjoyed this episode. Guns and chicken strips. And as always, we'll see you tomorrow. Big chickens.